As the situation in the Middle East continues to change by the minute, thousands of displaced Israeli families are trying to get to safer areas away from Hamas. 10 Tampa Bay's Angelina Salcido spoke with a woman on the ground there who was helping refugees while making sure her own family is protected. All of these efforts are possible through fundraising from this woman's family that is right here in Tampa. At least $77,000 raised to try and get refugees some resources and a brand new home. Ariel Pollock star and her family have lived in Israel for years. They are originally from the U.S. They were there when the attacks by Hamas happened and knew they needed to do something to get those without a home some help. Just a half hour from the Gaza border. It was pretty terrifying. Um, there was a lot of confusion. Ariel, her husband and four small kids were observing the Jewish Sabbath when the attacks by Hamas started. They were just about to walk to their synagogue. We gathered uh, in our safe room when the siren went off, uh, waited for it to be done. It was the start of continuing attacks in Israel and the displacement of thousands who were lucky to have made it out alive. Well, my husband is a physician. That's one of the reasons why we moved to Israel. He kind of just immediately jumped into action. Ariel focused on the immediate need on the ground. Today alone, I furnished 14 apartments, empty apartments in our town. Donations started pouring in privately and through a GoFundMe. The funds going to water, supplies for families, baked goods, and new places to call home. There's over 100 displaced families in our town. But in the midst of chaos, a moment of love. Ariel's collaborative kitchen space was able to cater a wedding, move to their town for safety. It was just such an incredible um, moment of togetherness that was at the, on the one hand, bittersweet, but on the other hand, um, just so beautiful and filled with gratitude. These private citizens are volunteers doing all they can to help one another in a time of crisis. Just responding to needs as they come up. Now those 100 refugee families are set to move into those apartments within the next week. Again, all of the money being raised is going straight to them. If you would like to support them, we have a link in this story on 10tampabay.com. In Tampa tonight, Angelina Salcido, 10 Tampa Bay.